All right, y'all. So I'm gonna start off by browning my turkey. This is turkey ground meat. Y'all already know that's all I use. And I put um, adobo seasoning in there. I put some saison seasoning in there. If you don't know about that, Google it. Yes, it's a Spanish uh, seasoning that a um, girl uh, hooked me on to. Um, and what else did I put in here? I put some fajita seasoning in there also. So I'm gonna brown that up. Oh yeah, <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. I'm gonna brown that up. And then after that, um, I'm gonna add my uh, enchilada sauce and my Rotel uh, diced tomatoes and chili. All right, y'all, so I drained my meat. And I put it in another pot, actually, because it wasn't enough room. And I'm gonna add two cans of these diced tomatoes and green chilies and two cans of this enchilada sauce. Hot enchilada sauce, yeah, y'all. Yeah. And this is the extra hot diced tomatoes and green chili. It's gonna be bomb. All right, y'all, so I added a medium-sized uh, yellow onion and some garlic, and I'm gonna mix all of this up and let the onions cook down, let everything um, melt together and mix together. And uh, then I'm just gonna add this mixture and some Velveeta cheese to, or tortilla, wrap it up, a corn tortilla, wrap it up, and start lining them up in the pan. And that's it, y'all. And then after that, I'm gonna actually only use some of this sauce for the inside of the uh, tortillas. And then after, I'm gonna have some um, leftover. I'm gonna pour it over all of the tortillas and then put cheese over it. Yeah, yeah, I'm enjoying me a nice Moscow mule. Y'all already know this is ginger beer. Uh-oh, I'll have the light on in there. This is ginger beer, um, vodka, and mint leaves, y'all. Yum, who wants a yummy sip? Mmm, it's so good, y'all. Nice and relaxing. All right, y'all, so this is what we're looking like. This is what it should look like. Now, the onions, it could cook a little bit more. But guess what? I'm ready to do this right now. Okay, so I'm about to start stuffing my tortillas, my corn tortillas. I have a yellow corn tortillas. Let me see. Let me let y'all see what I got. These are the tortillas I bought. These are the best tortillas ever, y'all. Super soft, super pliable, so you can roll them up and they don't split and break. All right? So, I'm about to start rolling them up. All I'm going to do is put that mixture in here, put um, some cheese, roll it up, and that's it, y'all. All right, y'all, so this is how I did it. I just have a piece of cheese under this mix mixture. I put that in there, and I'm going to roll it up and just start stacking them. That's it. All right, y'all, so I poured the rest of the meat mixture on top of the rolled uh, enchiladas, and now I'm going to put... Um, the rest of my imitation Velveeta queso with jalapeno cheese on top and then I'm going to put some uh, shredded cheese on top of there y'all and then I'm going to bake it on 400 until um, like the edges of these are like golden brown and the cheese is melted. So this is the first layer of cheese and I'm going to use sharp cheddar cheese and a Mexican blend cheese. There she is, y'all. Isn't she beautiful? Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to eat this. Yummy. Yummers! Y'all, check that out. Like, check it out. It's still bubbling in this piece. Like, yum! Yeah, I'm about to take it out. Oof, God, it smells so good. Yum, y'all, look at this. Yes, can't wait to eat right cool. now. Go on, so you gotta wait till they cool down. Freaking yum. Ooh, delicious, y'all. They covered in cheese. Ugh. I'm also making some yellow rice, y'all. Almost done. Mmm. What's up, yummy biters? 
happy Monday, you guys. Happy Monday and happy Tuesday to y'all because that's when y'all gonna get this video. Y'all, please start this video off with what? Thumbs, Thumbs it up. Subscribe, subscribe if you haven't already for everyday videos. Everyday videos. All right, y'all. So today we have some homemade, delicious enchiladas, okay? Y'all already saw how to make them. Let me know if that's how you make your enchiladas in the comments. And if you don't, let me know how you make yours. All right, y'all, we about to just start eating because we're starving. Straight up starving. Y'all let us know what y'all are eating with us. And... Oh, and y'all, um, I have a side salad here. I have some yellow rice with some pico de gallo on top. And Leia has a nice little salad. I'm so happy that she got. What kind of dressing do you like, Leila? Like, mm. what's your favorite? Ranch. Okay. That's the only dressing I ever eat. Really? Mm -hmm. This is my favorite dressing, y'all. Sesame ginger dressing. It is bomb. Oh, y'all, and we have some um, lime tortilla chips with some of this habanero green sauce. Because y'all probably can't see it. And y'all, y'all, mm-hmm. And I got my Jamaican me happy today. Uh-huh. Yes, y'all. Okay. I'm going to open that a little later. Ooh, y'all, I love rice like yellow rice or Mexican rice with pico de gallo on top. Oh my God. It's so good. Mmm. 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 Come now. It's spicy already. Yeah. Mmm. Y'all, and please excuse my hair. It is totally wet. Y'all let me know what y'all notice different about my hair. Let me know in the comments. I don't even know. Mm-mm. I had cut it, like, two months ago. I cut my ends. I need to cut your ends. You already cut my ends. Did I? Yes. They probably need to be cut again. Let's see, you was out getting like fairy knots or something. No? Yeah, I did say that. But I'm not as much anymore. Mm. Mm. I don't want. Because I meant when you cut my hair, it was like really short. It was. It's gonna, yeah. Really because you needed you needed your ends cut bad. So sometimes you have to cut off more when you wait a long time to get your ends cut. But it grew, didn't it? Mm -hmm. It was like really sure. I was like, what? And then y'all trying to play me like it's not that short. You can't even tell. Yes, it was. It was a little short, but it wasn't super duper short. Not to me. Mmm. Oh my god. Mmm. Oh, these are the best enchiladas mm -hmm. ever. And y'all, it's so weird because I use the cheapest cheese, y'all. I didn't even use Lovita cheese. I use H-E-B queso blanco, blanco cheese with jalapenos. And um, on top, I use a Mexican uh, cheese, Mexican mixed cheese, and a sharp shredded cheese on top. Y'all, it's off the chain. Mmm. Like my shirt? Mm-hmm. It's my birthday present. Where you get it from? Fashion Nova. This? Mm-hmm. Mm. Are you went shopping for yourself? Yeah, my birthday money. Oh. Oh. Mm. 
Mm. Mm. Yeah, this green sauce is so good. Shout out to Vern Bang for sending it to me. It's so good. somebody car. So how was school today? Good. Anything exciting so happened? we have a test, a four hour test. What's a Start? No, you know how what? they all would be doing all them practice benchmark. Oh, benchmark. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, for those of you who don't know, this is my hair. This is a wash and go that I did, like not too long ago. That's why it's not dry. What? You scraping your uh, fork on the thing. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, um, it's so spicy, y'all. <laughs> I used um, spicy enchilada sauce. I used spicy. What else? Um, I use extra hot Rotel. So good. Mm. So how's basketball been going? Good. What, what yeah. We have five people on the C team. Are you kidding me? Yes, and Why? we can't even play this Thursday because Navasota doesn't have a C team. It's so like every single time, like they see like they say like C team come and do something, and it's just it looks so bad, like like unorganized. It just looks bad. What you mean? Like. Three people are, like, supposed to be on C-Team. Like, yeah, you definitely need to be on C-Team. Mm -hmm. And then me and Deja, especially me, I need to be on B-Team. Mm -hmm. like, Did you tell your coach that? Did, that that's what you feel? No, filmed? I asked her why. She was like, well, and some of the, she was like, the people on B-Team are, like, better, and you guys are, like, need to work on things. I'm mm -hmm. like. And did you ask her what no. you need to work on? No. You're she so was telling everybody, like, um, how to handle the ball and stuff, but I already know how to do that. Do she feel like you know how to do that? I don't know. They be seeing me. Because that's what like, matters. They told me, she said, we need to practice on throwing the ball. What? Mm -hmm. I was sitting up there, who? That, like, that means so passing easy. the ball to each other. But when you get in the game, it's not that easy because you have yeah, another it team. Is. It's not, Lele. You have another They're team. They're trying to see if we could throw a ball to another another teammate. Right. right across you from have us. to know how to pass the ball. That's exactly. very important. I know how to pass the ball. But everybody else got to know too, Lele. Y'all a team. That's what I'm saying. Like, come see us practice one day. I passed my classes. I'm not bad at basketball. I'm actually kind of good, but I don't. I shouldn't be on CT. But passing your classes don't have nothing to do with being on CT. It's just a I skill. I said that that has to do with it. It's just your skill level, Lele. How they feel your skill level is. You might think that you're better than what they think. Even the other people, even the other teammates think I should be on B team. I don't know what they doing. Mm -hmm. Maybe I wasn't working hard enough when it was time for tryouts. Mm -hmm. But they said the team definitely aren't permanent and that um, we get moved at any time. She said some other stuff, but the, but the teams are not permanent. She was like, since we're on C team, we could like have goals and like work our way up to B team and A team. But how's anybody gonna work their way up when y'all only have five players? They need y'all. Huh? What? 
How is anybody going to work their way up from C-team if oh. y'all only have five players? They need every single last one of y'all. You can just not have a C-team, just like Navasota. I don't know. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Y'all, this is delicious. Y'all need to really try this at home. It is so good. I think this is the best, these are the best enchiladas I've made, honestly. Mm. Mm. I'm done. So, y'all, we want to thank y'all for supporting Leia. What? On your seafood so, boil. Oh, thanks. I wasn't expecting that. Was so excited. talk to them about it, how you was feeling and stuff. <laughs> really nervous. I was scared. It felt weird doing a video by myself. It just felt weird. But you did good. I did. For your first time. Um, but some king crab, I underestimated some king crab. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think they were going to be that pokey. Like, it literally poked me so hard. She didn't think it was going to be that hard for her to get them open. Yeah. Even when I tried to use the scissors, it was hard. Is there a napkin over there? Mm -mm. I feel like there's juice all over my mouth. There isn't. Is it? I'll tell you. Mm -mm. You don't have nothing on your mouth. I just want to talk. You alright? Can I have the chips and dip? Hmm, I'm put some in the pipe. Not in the ring. Good. The tips are really good. They have a really strong lime flavor to them. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Oh yeah! If y'all haven't checked out our family vlog channel, make sure y'all do so. I always link a video at the end of this video so y'all can see the latest vlog. These are so filling. Hmm? They're so filling. Really? I'm not full. Cool. Really? I know I should have got two three instead of two. But why didn't I? Mm -hmm. That's hard. That's nasty. No. Like. Ha! Ah. <gasps> it's, it's cheese. It's spicy. Ah! What is that? Green habanero sauce. That's real habanero uh, mm -hmm. seeds. It's not as hot as I would thought habanero would be, but. Oh, excuse me. It's Mexican night, y'all. 
Enchilada Tuesday. I would have did tacos, but it just didn't feel like it. Mm. So did you and uh, your friend talk about y'all's weekend at the mall? Yeah. At school? For a good thing, I said it. Hmm? For good things. What do you mean for good things? <laughs> for good things. They say, um, <gasps> it's spicy. For good things, they, they say good things at school. Raise your hand for a good thing. Oh, that's a, that's a thing. Okay. Oh, okay. But tomorrow, y'all, she thinks it's super hot. What? What'd you say? But tomorrow, what? It is hot. It's it. It is super hot. <clears throat> but tomorrow we have our writing benchmark, and then Wednesday we have math benchmark. Are you ready? Oh my God, yeah. What's so hot, Mama? I be getting the answers right. You know how the uh, Missy Bar um, thought I was cheating on the test when. Tell them what happened. Oh, so I be passing my test and I don't be actually doing the work, but I have an educated guess. I'm telling you, like, like I just know the answer and I pick the answer. I don't cheat, and I just been passing the test. You know, yeah, and so. She was. She asked me, "Was I cheating on the test?" Cause I asked her for my grade, and she was like, "The only reason why you're passing is because you're pat, um, you're passing the test." I don't know why she said that, cause I do everything in that class. But yeah, her teacher literally asked her, "Was she cheating because she passed the test?" Like, who does that? I mean, don't you think your teacher would be happy that you just passed your test? Like, unless she caught. Her cheating, she shouldn't have asked. Her. I thought that was so inappropriate, y'all. Like, let me know in the comments and what y'all think. We were doing a review, and I picked the answer without doing no work. I just knew the answer. Mm -hmm. I just circled the answer, mm -hmm. and I asked Miss uh, Hadad, the student teacher, the the student teacher, you know, the helper. Mm -hmm. But um, she was like, there there was a right answer all along, and mm -hmm. she. She, was, she told me it was wrong. We had to do all this work to get the same answer that I picked. And I was like, really? I had the right answer the whole time. Okay. And that's proven to them that I just know the answer. So you ha you mean you had to do the work to get the answer? No. I just read the question and mm -hmm. answered it. What kind of word? Math. Mm. They be having us do all that work and it's unnecessary. Well, on some questions, it's unnecessary. Well, they want, I know what you're talking about. They want you to do it the long way yeah. to get the answer. Yeah. 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 And that's just, that takes way too long and that's too much. Mm hmm. It's annoying. I remember that in school too. They want you to do the whole entire problem, then get the answer. Yeah. When, in fact, sometimes there's short ways to get the answer. You know what I'm saying? It's so ridiculous, but sometimes you got to do it just because the teacher said so. Sometimes if you don't have, if you don't have like two, if you don't have like uh, two answers that you think are the right answers, then you try to solve it. But if you do, just pick one. Pick the right one. <laughs> Mm-mm. Y'all, that's her new sweater that she is obsessed with. Who said I was obsessed mm -hmm. with it? I thought you loved it. Yeah. Are I like the obsessed? color because my I love pink and red. Especially red. But the guy Me in the too. store. The guy at you know, he was like, um, I was holding up the red one and this one, and he was like, the pink one. Oh, really? Yeah. You still got both of them. 
A red one and a pink one. That would have been cute. Oh, but it wasn't like this. It was kind of like crop with like two drawstrings right there. It was cute. With a hoodie. Yeah, the hoodie. Oh, I bet you that was cute. It was just all red. Like that. I bet you that was cute though. How much was it? You remember? 14. Were they on sale or something? No. Mm. They were on the big, uh, like, so everybody could see that thing. I'm almost done. Getting a oh, little fully full full what? I put the ten dollars in I mean the fifteen dollars in the uh the, your backpack? In the chocolate money in my backpack. As soon as I got home, because I don't want to forget it. I can what did you do? Like oh, I handed I, it to and you. And I gotta bring the chocolate box to school too. Cause I didn't sell all the chocolate. What? Well what did you do? Like when I handed you the money, what did you do? I had my I had my phone. The money was like on the back. I was holding it, and then mine was like time to go. And then I guess I I had the money, my phone and the money at the back, and I was go sit down. Mhm. Mm and I put the money down. I thought y'all was about to and go. I guess I sat on it, and then my I was on my phone. Mine was like time to go, and I was like oh time to go, and I just left, and then I left it on. Oh. Bed. I was like, I literally just gave this girl this dang of money and she forgot it. Oh, Lord. Anyway, <clears throat> y'all, I'm fully full, 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 and I know she is. Mm -mm. You, Well, that's all the food you got on your plate. <laughs> anyway, y'all, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please thumbs up this video. Subscribe if you haven't already for everyday videos. Everyday videos. All right, and we will see you guys on tomorrow. Peace. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Love y'all. Bye. Say bye, girl. What? Out bye. your finger in your mouth. Mm. <clears throat> Yummers. Oh, excuse me. These are good. Mm. Mm. <laughs> uh oh. That's gonna be Take bad. Your thing off. Oh no, man. What? Make sure you get your plate. Ping pong. See you later. Oh, what about your channel? You never um. Are you still making videos? What's going on? No. I posted no? video here. Oh, okay. Y'all make sure y'all check out the description box. It has all of my channels in there. Uh, it has all my social media. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Insta. <laughs> and I need to go dry my hair because this is ridiculous. Y'all look how long my hair is. Watch what it shrink up to. Yeah, it's longer than that. But can you stop, please? I'm fine. Ouch. It's uh pretty friggin' long. Yeah, it's getting long because I don't touch it, y'all. Oh, because I don't touch it's it. So this how you natural. I don't. Hair? I don't touch my hair. So, Mama. Since I twist it and I I put it under wigs, Mama. it grows. What? I'm talking. <laughs> what? You're her naturally thin? Yes. Oh. Then my my hair naturally thin. Yes. All of our hair is it's fine, actually. It's not thin. It's fine. We have fine hair. That's what it is. My hair isn't dried yet. That's why it looks like that. It isn't dry. It's not going to be looking like this. It's going to draw all the way up. Probably up to here. Mm. Yeah, y'all. Bye, y'all. Mukbang, a mukbangin', mukbang, a mukbangin', mukbang. Are we hangin', we bang, are we bangin'?